is it that some candidates do exceptionally well at the medical school interview, whereas most others are at best average? Is it because they have natural ability? Is it because they spend more time drudging through books and articles? The answer to both questions is no. There are three simple reasons for their success, and the good news is the results can be replicated by anybody. So what are these three reasons? Well, first of all, they learn specific strategies. Second of all, they learn precise information. And third of all, they practice a critical amount. So how can you use this information to ace your medical school interview? Well, let me put it to you like this. Think back to revising for your biology GCSE. Did you find that you learned more in one hour of going through past exam papers with your teacher than were you to have spent five hours with a biology textbook revising by yourself? The answer to that is probably yes. So why did you gain so much in that one hour? It's because you know that commonly questioned topics are likely to be repeated. So that means you would familiarise yourself with the mark scheme. You would know what a model answer looked like, so you knew what it would take to gain 100% in your biology GCSE. So essentially what you did was, you created strategies for answering these commonly questioned topics. You learned the specific information that the mark schemes were looking for. And you practiced a critical number of past papers so that you could write your own answers out fluently in the exam. Aren't these some of the reasons that you did so well in your biology GCSE? Now imagine you used to do your biology GCSE again, but this time you didn't have access to the biology textbook, to past exam papers, to model answers, to mark schemes, all the curriculum, and you had to revise completely alone. You would find that it would take you far more time and you'd go through far more pain and frustration trying to prepare because you wouldn't know what to expect and there'd be gaps in your knowledge. This would probably stop you from fulfilling your potential and you'd probably drop a grade or two. Quite a daunting prospect. Now this is the situation that you and all your competitors are in at the moment with the medical school interview. You aren't given access to the interview curriculum or the mark schemes, so you don't know what you're going to be asked in the interview or how much detail you need to know it in. But what if I was to tell you that a medical school interview curriculum did exist? And in fact, we can predict 80% to 100% of the questions that you'll be asked in your medical school interview. Your first question would probably be, how did we manage to get our hands on this information? Well, every year we have hundreds of students attending our medical school interview courses. And most of them will write back with the questions that they get asked in their medical school interviews. So we know the specific questions and topics that are commonly questioned at each UK medical school. Plus, we even know when interview patterns start to change. This means that the information that we have is bang up to date. This is the reason why we have a 95% medical school admission success rate. And this is the reason why we are the only course to offer you a 100% money back guarantee that you get into medical school. Getting into medical school no longer has to be an unrealistic dream. It can be your reality today. You will learn more in two intensive days of interview preparation with us than were you to spend six full weeks revising by yourself. If you wish to attend ACE the Medical School interview course, please do book your place on acemedicine.com today. It could be the single most important thing that you do for your interview preparation. Unfortunately, we won't have seats and spaces for everybody who does watch this video. So if you do wish to attend, please do book early to avoid disappointment. Thank you very much for listening and good luck with your interview preparation.